All right, well, we're back here at the 2011 National Train Show in Sacramento, California. We're here with Dana Larson, who's in sales and customer service for Woodland Scenics. Dana's going to share some really cool new releases. Uh, Dana, tell us about some of the new buildings that you've got coming in. Okay, first I'll start with our prefab buildings. And um, this is our new release. It's called D's Diner. Um, and the way that these come is in a prefab, the, the walls are put together, um, but nothing is painted. The okay. only thing that's painted, I believe, is the car. And so it's a kit, so it's for people that really want to, you know, do the painting and details uh -huh. themselves. Paint these and glue them together onto the buildings. Um, this is the way they come with the walls put together. So this is our great new um, D's Diner. Now, Dana, as we look at it, there's a ton of detail here. Yes. I, I mean, I see some, there's a full interior mm -hmm. looking at uh, several figures, some bicycles, uh, lots of signs. Everything comes with this particular kit, correct? Yes. All the decals, everything you see comes with the kit. All right. So okay. you've done this in HO. Yep, in HO and, scale. And now you're coming with something similar in N scale? Um, yes, we have um, Drive and Dine. Now this is a built and ready kit. Okay. And what built and ready kit means is that you take it out of the package, just like this, put it on your layout. This is what you get. It's painted, detailed, everything. It's beautiful. So all the details come pre-installed just as you see it right here? Yes, yes. Wow. Now this has been, a, there's been a, something new in the line that recently. Uh, that's shipped, and that's the weathered barn, and it's kind of a departure for modelers and, and modeling. Tell us a little bit about what makes this so different. Okay, this is my favorite. This is um, uh, the new HO weathered barn, and as you can see, uh, look at those details. Look how it's weathered, and um, it's just beautiful. So, it, I know, so as we're looking around, some broken windows, notice mm -hmm. one of the barn doors is, is kind of fallen off to one side. There's some holes in the roof on the other side. Yep. The cupola's even got some uh, broken boards, so it has a lot of character to it. Yes, it does. And I noticed that uh, it looks like maybe there's something else coming in the line mm -hmm. with a new house that maybe follows in that same vein. Yes, uh, this is the old homestead, uh, something that you would see along a gravel road in the country, just, you know, and again, the weathering and the details are just impeccable. Um, and again, this is a built and ready. You take it out of the package and you put it on your layout. So notice as we're looking at this particular one, you've got an outhouse. Uh-huh, yes. Uh, I've got an old well pump and yep. even an old hound dog sleeping on the front porch. You got it. <laughs> wow, great looking model. Aren't they fun? So, and then uh, another thing that Woodland does a lot with, there are figures. Mm -hmm. And, yes. And one of the fun ones that we just, uh, that we just shipped. <laughs> yeah. This is our black Angus cows. And what makes this funny, of course, Woodland Scenics, we're all about um, realism mm -hmm. and details. Well, these cows have cow patties with them. <laughs> <laughs> so speaking of details, and you know, there's a couple of new things, too, in the O-Gage line as well as HO to help enhance mm -hmm. scenes. Can you tell us a little about those, too? Yes. Um, we are coming out with new accessories. Um, mm -hmm. One is called street accessories with uh, parking meters and benches. Um, this last year, we're really coming out with um, things that make your layout have more detail. Okay. Um, the accessories. Um, uh, also, people taking steps. Mm -hmm. We've been asked for that um, many times, so we finally came out with HO scale. Uh, people taking steps, and um, we'll probably come out with it in different scales also. Okay. So another neat uh, item are flowering trees, a new, mm -hmm. some new lineup for Woodland Scenics. Tell us what uh, different ones there are. Okay. Uh, the Woodland Classics line, um, this is a fairly new line of trees that we have come out with. And what makes these special is it's our originally um, uh, original foliage that when Woodland Scenics first came about, mm -hmm. um, uh, it's the first foliage that we developed. Really? And it gives the trees a lacy look, uh, very realistic looking. Um, but as I was saying, these Woodland Classics, they're about two years old, and these are new uh, flowering and fruit trees. This is the cherry blossom tree, as there, an example. And there's also an orange tree. and An orange tree and apple tree, and they are shipping now. All right. Okay. Well, Dana, a lot of neat things from Woodland Scenics, and as always, you make modeling a lot of fun. Yes. We truly you. appreciate your time here at the National Train Show, and the products on this video are available from uh, HorizonHobbyTrains.com as well as your local hobby retailer. Okay, thank you, Thanks, Shane. Dana. All right.